once all nine tiles are out, that's when those four uh, celebration day tiles, uh, Alex will get mad at me, I can't remember the names of them, but we'll, we'll throw those four tiles in here. When three of those are pulled on any person's turn, that ends the game immediately. Even if you're in the middle of your turn, even if you had one really cool thing to do, it's you're over. done. It's over. You said so, three, right? Yeah, when three of those are pulled okay. out. Uh, so, on your turn, the cool thing, it's got a nice little reference sheet, all right? Your robots that are active are the ones on the right side. They're standing up. The robots that are not active are the ones that are laying down on your left side. I thought they were just taking a nap. They're sleepy. They're tired. <laughs> they're trying to open a city up. So when you look at that, there you can activate more robots if you want to. If you want to, all you got to do is spin on your turn the number of prestige points that it says on the left side. So if you want to activate this one and bring that one in, it'll cost you two. The next one's four. The next one's six. It's up to you if you want to bring in more robots. Uh, more more workers, right, for worker placement game. More workers could be better. So, yeah. so what do we do on our turn? We're going to roll the three production dice. Once the city, the one sees gears are in the bag, that's when the city is ready and open and for business, and everything's producing heavily. So that's when we we'll use that fourth one. Till then, we just roll these three dice. We see what comes up. On our dice, we have a couple of different rolls here. Are they seeing that at the top? Oh, oh, let me bring that up. So, we got the gears which match up to here. That's for choosing gears out of the bag and placing them out on the thing. Choosing gears is a way to build up your engine, all right? This is literally. For, oh, absolutely, building up your engine. We've got a lot of movement uh, tokens that are gonna be on here. We've got regular movement tokens that'll move one of your robots one spaces. Uh, and then the zap tokens, which if they come out, this will allow you to zap a robot on any links you have all the way down, as long as they're connected. So this is for a really quick movement, and this is for fast. This is for just solitary movement, one at a time. You might say, why would I ever take these versus these? These are better, right? Well, these here can be unlimited in storage. At the end of your turn, you're going to burn whatever resources you don't use, but you can store as many as you want onto that little space. On this side of your board, you're limited to how much you can store. You can store one cloud, one gear, one zap, and then one of anything, just one of anything you want. It's like a wild oh, so storage. I put this. That's yours. That's yours for starting. Yes, yeah, so you should put it over there for now. And you can do the same thing and you should have uh, one for starting. Uh, your, 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 prestige, your prestige token. All right, so that's that's what these guys do versus what these guys do. These will be used. So when you roll this shape, you only get to take this one? You actually can spin it right as a dice. If you don't spin it during the turn, you can turn it in like that and put this on your token like that. Okay. So they're interchangeable. The dice versus the tokens are totally interchangeable. You can use them however you want. So I've rolled my dice. What I'll do then is I would pick what I want to do. I would activate city. Yeah, three dice. Oh, oh, now he wants to know how many zap tokens you need before you can zap Travis with a taser. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, it's three. 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 So the next part, and here's the here's the critical thing. The only critical thing in the game that you really have to worry about. Part critical one, thing. two, and three have to be done in that order. So after I roll my dice, the number two thing is going to activate the city tiles. We got a number of city tiles out here on the floor. We can't see them yet. So the first turn, we're not really going to be doing that. Part two, we're going to zoom right past it. But once we do have tiles that are out on the board. If we have one of our robots on that tile, we can activate it. We'll spend the resources to make that tile do something. It'll, it'll produce more zaps, it'll move people around, it'll give us more gears, it'll do something cool. And that's activating it. Once you're finished activating it, once you activate your tile, then you also get link bonuses. We have these gears inside this bag. They look just like those white ones over there. As we put gears out, we're actually, let's say that I have this tile and it's activated, and I've got these tiles all connected. I can activate that tile and then link everything else and take those bonuses. So boy, you can really change up, chain up some combalicious moves by chaining up all of your actions. Over That's here. right in Jesse's wheelhouse. Oh, wow. Or should I say gear house? Gear house. <laughs> <laughs> so the, the cool thing about this is you get to decide which ones do you want to activate versus which ones do you want to take that link bonus because Joe you can't do both we'd love to do both in life yeah. <laughs> right you can activate these two tiles and take the link bonuses here or you can activate this one and take all three you're gonna have to decide what you want to do based on what resources you have and what your plan is okay then the next thing you do is performing the actions but you can't perform any of these actions until after you finish your activations okay when you uh, when you're doing the actions it's easy you just follow the uh, rules you can move a robot one space 
using these things or move it all the way across your gear links using these. You can draw gears once per turn. You can draw gears and you can spin one here, one of your gears here and one of your gears here. Why would you put them here versus here? Because this is your part of the city and this is the cool things you get to do. So you can add five cool things to your city. If it fills up, you can even trade one out. If you take another one, you can spin it out. But you can only put one in the city per round. All right? You can also put gears out here. Why do you want to put gears out there? Because you want to try to occupy the tiles, flipping them over. You get a, a little two-point bonus for flipping it over. And you can also you know, occupy that tile so you can take the activation. So again, you're trying to figure out which ones it is. But you can pull a ton of gears. What if, I, what if all of these dice were gears and one of these things allowed me to get even more gears that's okay. Pulling five gears out gives you more options to pick the two that you want. So it's okay, but you're still limited to just those two gears. You can also overcharge. At the end, remember I told you you're limited to one zap and then one extra one here? Well, if you, if you have some kind of crazy Jesse ending, engine and you got like five zaps, you can spin the zaps and, uh, at the, oh, sorry, that's at the end of the turn. You can overcharge. You can destroy somebody's robot. So you can spin one zap to destroy a robot, or even two zaps to demolish somebody's gear, leaving them without that little connection. So zaps are fun for movement, zaps are fun for destroying stuff, and then at the end, once you finish with your turn, you, you burn all your overages, and if you have any zaps left over, sell them and get yourself a point for each one that you sell. Okay. That's how you roll your turn. It's gonna be a lot more. Uh, it's gonna be a lot easier as we roll it through. Any questions from the chat? No, <laughs> Slivers are just making fun of me because we've been here. We we. We've been running since 6.30 this morning, Silver. I think I'm entitled to a yawn. Yes, yes. It has nothing to do with my teach, I'm sure. So, all right. All right, right. I'm, I'm, I was riveted. I'm sure. It's a boring teach. All right, here we go. Let's see if I got most of this game right. Yeah. All right, I'm going to roll. I'm going to pick up a lot as I go along. I'm going to okay. roll it. And we'll Just see. one person at a time. One person at a time. Okay. All right, so I got, this one is not a combo. This is an either or. Great. So I got this, this, and this. Uh, I do need some movement. Uh, I did. I'm first, so I did not start with the movement, right? I should have had that. Ah. Yeah, yeah. You started. I think you were those. just showing it as an example. I was showing it was as an example. Exactly right. Okay, so I am going to. Uh, did Joe start with the movement? No, no. Not. Just, wow. He starts with prestige, and you guys start with uh, movement and a prestige. Yeah. Movement and prestige. Okay, so I'm gonna uh, take my cloud because I don't plan on burning it right now. Uh, let's see. I do want a gear so I can get out of this uh, little city here. So we'll take that. And then I uh, want to zap, not ready to move yet, so I'll take the zap over here. I can do it that way. I'm just doing it mentally. I'm burning my uh, dice. I, I can also just, you know, just Add spin the them. things and then spin them. Exactly, yeah. which is really the thing. So I think what I'll do is uh, I'm going to spin. I'm going to, uh, can't, I can't activate occupied tiles or gain any link bonuses. I can't move because I don't really have any movement um, and, and there's nowhere to move. I could move to this tile though and flip it over. So I, I, I think Seems I could good. do that. Yeah, I think I'll do that. It's two points to you, right? Yeah, I'll do that. So I'll, I'll spin that over here and move to that one. I'm just wondering what your motivation is otherwise, you know? Yeah, I'm not really a method actor, so I'm just playing this straight. <laughs> I really, that's the yeah. best, I, best I can do. So I'll set up like this, tell everybody what it is. It's the Opulent Garden. Opulent Garden. It's a green tile. It says that uh, right here is the, this is the link bonus. So when I'm doing all of those different links, and this is the activation. If I spin this, these things, if I have a robot on it, and I spin a cloud, and I spin a gear, I can gain two points. At the end of the game, if I have more robots and, or, and more uh, gears on it, I'm gonna get three points for having it. So it's okay. sort of a little area control mechanic though. Do you get anything for flipping it over? I do, I got two points for it. Uh, where did I go? Yeah, usually this is how we do it. Um, Take all those little green ones. I stacked them up over here, and we'll just put them right on top of the tiles, so you won't forget. Uh, okay. You can just money. take one of those. Yep. You can also spin spin it like money, and this is uh, by the way, this is hidden information. Oh, how many points I have is yep. hidden. It's hidden information, so you can flip it you over. You guys have no idea how many I have. Yeah, now. yeah, exactly. I so, got countless. So I can flip this over and over chat room, and it doesn't matter. So I've got the two though. If I want to activate a robot later on, so I flipped it over. I've got my thing there. Um, Let's see, let's see. How do you get a movement token? Um, you, you can get a movement token by basically rolling them, right? Is there on there? I didn't notice first. Uh, there should be movement on there. 
Uh, oh, okay. So right? these guys, the the tiles are uh, generated, and also the uh, oh, the gears. The gears. Okay. All right. So I have one gear. I'm gonna spin that gear, and I'm gonna draw one tile out there. <laughs> no. And I've got to uh, roll up to two fewer dice. Gain one for each die. Hmm. So I could roll fewer dice and gain more money. I don't think. Oh, I messed that up. So I was supposed to do it this way. Here's my here's my gear. I apologize, chat room. I didn't have a connection to it. So there's my there's my thing there. I Here's connect to it now. Does that make sense? I did that backwards. So there's my gear link, and there's my robot moving to flip over the tile. I did it backwards. That's the end of my turn. I'm gonna keep this over here. I don't have any spoil overages, so it's gonna be your turn. So I get a, a cloud. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> hey, no. Wow. I get a cloud. Two clouds. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, oh, wow. yeah, we're on Twitch right now. So we shouldn't be asking you questions right now. No, that's all right. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Well, they're asking us questions. Definitely show up the costume. Or the, the, uh, cosplay. We haven't yet, Slivers. Can they can they see the guys on the uh, Twitch? Oh, they can absolutely. like see them kind of behind you, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And you guys are from the 501st five, five Legion. Five Legion that are here five taking Legion. pictures with everybody. Oh, awesome. there's a stormtrooper coming. <laughs> so I get, I get two clouds in a gear. That's what we're doing. Yes, exactly. You get two clouds in a gear. If you want to, or you can just spin them if you want to okay. during a turn. At the end of your turn, you, whatever you don't what do you spin, do with, you'll do it. What do you do with like the clouds? The clouds are going to be used for spinning stuff like this. Okay. Yeah, they're basically currency. Waiter is one of the uh, sponsors of the event, so we'll be ordering something through Waiter. You probably have to explain right. so what it is. So you want to get into like here, and the only way to get into there is to do like <laughs> yes. I did, is I to put a gear on. Right, so spin food. your gear. Spin it's a locally gear. owned company that not it's many people here use wide. Uber Eats. We we all use Waiter. Gain two for each one of your unbuilt robots. But it started it's here in Louisiana. It's an you got it. Some of the uh, gears out there, check room, they have uh, in-game scoring instead of bonuses right now. So he can keep that and put that in-game, or you can use it to get out of your city if you want to try to get some bonuses. Um, so what was his draw? Probably. What is... Uh... Yeah, so just oh, flip, it, I can't. flip oh, it over like this it. and put your token on top of it. Fancy. I had to do that so I could get this. I did it backwards by accident, but... I had to do this oh, to you, get there. If you keep it back here, you get to use what's on, on the... Yeah, if you, it's over here, okay. you're going to get the bonus. If not, I mean, you can use it once per turn to help you out. Okay, but that's an in-game thing, so it's probably not really Yeah, it's probably it. not that worth it right now. Okay. We are located yeah, right now for Robot the convention out, right? in Lafayette, Louisiana. You do. You can always... Uh, let me make sure, but I Southern think you can always spend fast. two if you want to yeah. to try to move. We are usually out of Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Uh, let's make sure that... But today we, we drove over to Lafayette. I drive for a waiter. Oh, yeah, Lazy Owls. Yeah, we... Uh, He's over in uh, Houston-ish area. Yep, yep, they've expanded out there for sure. Yep. That's yeah, right, ladies and gentlemen. streamers over there. All right, it's been a while since you've done a board game stream, though. You're always doing yeah. video games. Well, that's Twitch, right? <laughs> yeah, that's true. All right, I think so, that's right. Uh, to you can spend no, dice trying to figure out something for three. You could use your converter future. right there. There we go. And it was in there. Oh, okay. All right, I did forget to tell you, everybody has one converter automatically already started. That mm -hmm. one can never leave the board, so you can't switch it. It allows you to change any two resources of, of a one type, I mean, any two resources into the type that you want. Joe's trying to move. He's got two clouds he can't even use. Right. If I were him, I'd spin those two clouds, yeah. convert them to a movement, and uh, jump onto that uh, oh, tile. Yeah. That gives you two, and you can flip it over so we can't see the so other side. So what typically does he have to spin to move? Normally you would use a green one to move one movement, oh. or like I did, a zap to move as far as you as, as far as you can with your links. And where is that actually stated? I was looking for that. Yeah, uh, that it says destroy, demolish. I don't see the moving. Oh, at the top it says right under perform actions in any order, move robot. Okay. Yep. And that's this for one space across any gear link you own, uh -huh. and this for all the spaces you have that you have a gear link. So I could, if I had gear links here, here, and here, I could go whoop, all the way to there. Okay, <clears throat> so overturn. So tell us about your tile. Yeah, choose up the two robots belonging to other players and immediately move them across one of the their what is it? All right, <laughs> their gear. Yep. The owner each to move robots gains one. Yeah, so you're like the monorail at Disney World. You can actually move us around. 
and plus gears <laughs> if you activate your top. It's a worth it's worth a big whopping five points in the end. Hello, bro. If you have your uh, air control. And that's your turn? You had any, you had any overage? No. Nope. nope. Alright, Jesse, you're up. Alrighty. Here we go. Rolling. I have some lightning, I have some clouds, I have some gear clouds. Do you mind? Which what are you all? Oh, yeah, one of each. Not this one, right? Yeah. Not that one. That okay. one's my fourth die. I guess okay. that's taken by some special thing. Yep. So you've um, got a gear if you want to use a gear to try to get to the next you know, to the first city tile if you want. I would and love you, to do that. And you have a zap which allows you to move onto that tile because it'll move as far as you as you want on your thing. Okay, so I'm so pulling a I gear, spin this in a gear. Here. Yep. I was doing some uh, technical stuff during during uh, rules. So We're gonna I walk you through quite it. a few. So this is an in-game thing. Is it public? Yep, it is public. Uh, okay. No, it's you. You don't have to tell us, but for the purpose of the twitch. Hey, thank you, Matt. Appreciate it. Yeah, All right, this so is an in -game if thing. I were you, I'd put it down right there. Yeah, let's and place that. it, place it upside down. Take one of your control markers and put it on there. So now we know you own it. I do own that. Now you can move if I you want move, to. I can move, or I can use this thing to move, right? Yeah, you have that one. Is yeah. this a precious resource, though? It's or? not, man. You, it's can, not. Can, you can keep it as board. long as you want. The other ones you can't keep. That's as fair. Many. I just rolled this. Let's get rid of that to move. No, out. that you can keep. But then in this turn, one, you can convert your you can zap. And then you can. But convert. that's only used for that purpose. Well, this is only used for that purpose, right? There's nothing else that, that does except movement and very few this ties. Thing, let's yeah, I would run it if I were you. There is one in-game bonus that says collect all these things. I mean, let's come over here and we don't even know if it's in the game. What this is? All right, we're gonna flip this over. You got yourself a bonus of two points. Jesse, you got the casino. You're, you're a gambling man. I am today. You can get you can get victory points for gambling. If you activate this tile by putting your robot on it. Uh -huh. And spinning one gear, then you're gonna roll that die. Right. If it rolls zaps, you get four points. If it's one of these things, it's one point. If it is uh, the combo one, the Ooh, slash one, on you lose one. points. Well, I wow. probably won't be a gambler. You you might be a gambler man. <laughs> That's not his tile, by the way. All we have to do is get on there, and we can start activating it too. As long as we as long as we have a robot casino. on there. Yeah, we can visit the casino. So, so is his robot standing on there? Yeah, his robot is. Sorry, that's my bad. Um, and that leaves me with one cloud, which I could store this stuff up, right? Yeah, store yourself a cloud. Because what else is it good for at this moment? Clouds. What is it good for? Clear. Absolutely nothing. And that's just, you're going to use this. And I also a bolt, uh, because I didn't spend it. I spent the little, there you go. little face. I think you're good. I think I'm good. You could have spent both of those to get two gears out, but you know, this is nice having those for next time. Yeah. And you were done. Over to yellow. The Mega Corp. Oh wow, the what a roll there. Look at that. Is Tons it? of gears. Yeah, you have a movement and you got you got more gears than we got to pick. So you're gonna like that. What does that mean? You get to draw get these gears in to take gears out of here? Yeah, you get to pull two of Just them out there. Just draw two out right now? Just draw two of them out right now. You can't leave your city part and go into the city. You can't leave your little factory until you have gears. All right, there's your choices. What yeah. you got? You can tell us or, you know, if you want to just keep it private. My suggestion would be put one of them here and put the other one here. But that's just a suggestion put one, from a guy one, who's one. never won. Put so one down here, put one up to here. What do they do if I put them under here? Here, that's a anytime you want, once per turn, you can use all the tiles you have underneath your board, on your board. So that that would be something you want, like either in game or something that gives you a bonus, like grant, get an extra movement tile. Well, this yeah. gains movement when I build a gear. That's an awesome one. Yep. Okay, so I'll put that down here. All right. Like that. Flip that one upside down and put it over here and put one of your uh, control tokens on top. All right, now what do you want to do? I have no idea. I have a cloud. <laughs> yeah, I stored and my cloud. you have that. You have a movement. Yeah. So I probably want to move out onto the... To get the out okay, I'll do that. So All right, so burn that the movement. city. Grab your robot, move to the city. It's a little far from me. Yeah. This does have a very particular table size yeah. demand. I like the steampunk art, though. I think the steampunk... Uh, oh, yeah. The, the theme At the right table. Through. Yeah. 
So I think, uh, and I Alex, don't take this wrong. There? I think the tiles could have been brighter. You a little bit. your the green, contrast uh, is kind of that green movement thing. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Where did I actually move? Like onto here? And no, you moved onto here. You moved, you moved across. Picture this as a bridge. They call it a gear link. You have to, you have to place this to move yeah. onto here, right? So if yeah. you want to move over here, you just want to place one here. He needs one there. Yeah. Right. Or if yeah. you move here, you But he doesn't want to move here. He wants to move toward the wrist. So I moved like across this. You did. You that just counts that as one. That's it. You spent one movement. Yeah. All right, you got your two points. That's it. All right, what does this tile do for us? I don't know, man. A uh, merchant bank. He's got the bank. You gain two something for yep. each something. You're going to gain two here. of these. Notice that this is a good time to talk about it. Notice that each of the tiles have colors on them. Mine, is, mine and Ronald's are green. You guys have red. There's one more color, blue. They, you, they're also, for, for people with color problems, they also have symbols at the top. They each represent a different type of building in the city. So he's trying to collect occupation of those kind of buildings, the merchant buildings, mm -hmm. like the garden or the merchant bank, the richer you know, uh, buildings. So that's what this one says. He's gonna gain two uh, prestige for each one of these tiles that your robot occupies, including this one. So if he, if he activates this tile by spinning a zap and his robot is on this one and on this one, he's gonna get four prestige points every right. time I don't have it. a zap. Wow. Not right now, but we're I building the engine for later yeah, so in the game. Get a cloud. I don't really know what to do with the cloud well, at this point. Well, mine, mine requires clouds some to spin. Of them, yeah, some of them require the clouds. Some of them. Okay. And so, do, no, I'm the only one. But a lot of these tiles require clouds to spin. You can also spin two clouds or a cloud and something else to get movement or zap, whatever you want. Okay. And zaps are fun because we can destroy each other's little gear links. All right, my turn. All right, oh, I got lots of clouds, so I did get a gear. Uh, I think I'm gonna try to move to that center, take a little control. Uh, I could activate this though, if I yeah. wanted to. I could spin this cloud and this gear, but I won't have any movement. I won't be able to move over there, so I don't think I'm gonna do that. So I think what I'm gonna do is, uh, oh, I really like to activate that. It would give me two points right away. But I think what I'm gonna do is I will uh, take the gear, and save this for movement so I can get over there. So let's just try that out and see what happens. You know what the average score of this game is? Like yeah, it's like three million is usually the winning score. Three so, million? Okay. Yeah, three so million. two isn't that much then. I want to say in the seventies <laughs> ish. Seventies. Unless you're Bradley, then it's like 150. Right. So yeah. So I have an in-game one. Gain uh, for each tile you occupy with a robot but don't own. Ooh. So that's me just sending robots out. I don't yeah. even care if you guys have it. If and you how do you show ownership again? Just being um, you're having the most on the tile. Most, right? most the uh, gear links and robots on the tile. Oh, that's an interesting one. But it's so early for end game though. Yeah, yeah I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go to the center, right? I'm gonna think like chess. The center is always the most important part of the board. I have no idea if that's, that's, that's gonna work. <laughs> we'll see. All right, and then I'm gonna burn these two guys here for movement because I'm converting them using this. For helpful for for new players, I would put this here. To remind myself that I already played it because you're going to forget later on when you start playing these things. Same thing with the tiles, you can throw your ownership things on there. So let's throw this over here. All right, we got uh, the junk shop. This is another one of Ronald's tiles, he likes those green ones. Choose up to two die dice from your opponents and roll them for use during your turn. The owner of each dice takes taken gains two, return the dice at the end of your turn. So I borrow your dice. But if I do that, I got to pay you, I mean, you're going to gain two from the uh, board. But if I really need a good roll, I can borrow other people's dice, give them the points right. out of the bank, and use those. That's an interesting one. It does have a link bonus, and that's getting more gears. So, um, very interesting. So I burnt my movement to go over there. I got my things. I don't have anything left. I burned all my clouds, so I'm good. You're up. Lightning cloud gear. Okay. So this is a convert a gear to two clouds, right? Yep. One gear equals two clouds. I don't think I'll 
So the other option he has is to play down here and you could yeah, use it. Yeah, I can see that. I'd rather have gotten this on my turn since I built a gear. What is that? Gain over. one when you build a link. Yep, give yourself a, a movement. There you go. Sorry about that. Can I move another Sorry. robot out with this? Yeah, you, you're yeah. not limited to that robot. No, you can do this one. Yep, you sure can. That. Smart move. So it's not an adjacent. He's, oh, well, he's, he's, connected. he's played board games before. Huh? Yeah, he's, he's, he's. I just wondered in the day. Yeah. <laughs> what is this going on? Yeah, you saw this game called Catton at a store on Tuesday, Catton, and ever yeah. since then you've been playing board games like crazy since Tuesday. K Tan. K Tan. Since y'all got that K Tan? <laughs> what you got? Return any number of your robots from city tiles to your factory. Game one for each robot you return. Ah, the pullback tile. So what's the name of it? Chronotorium. Yes, yeah, so if you want to. Oh, that's a blue one. Yeah, like, if you want to, you can send your robots all the way back and get a, get a bunch right. of stuff. So. Right. And then I'll collect the cloud. All right, there we go. And I'm done. Man, everyone has cloud store. Once again, clouds are good for what? <laughs> They're using the paper things. They're like currency. Yeah. yeah. But nothing else. Well, you can convert wow. two of them into something to another thing. So. Yeah. Yep. Oh, with a converter, sure. Yeah, you can use converter only once per turn. But it, it seems yeah, like the most useful. <laughs> all right. It just depends on the tiles. A lot of times, it's mostly clouds, and it's all about generating that engine. So, all right. Sometimes movement seems, you know, useless. It just depends on the way the tiles come out. And to move costs lightning. Mo move is the green ones. They go one oh, space. Sorry. Lightning will let you go like he did all the way across his gear lengths as far as he wants. Okay. One, it's just uh, strange that it's not under the actions part. It's under move right there, perform actions. Move. But I mean, it doesn't say anything about it does, it does. lightning. The, the, yeah. the quantity yeah. that means. Yeah, like the other ones we say lightning to destroy, it should say lightning to move. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yep. Weird. Yeah, a little bit a little bit more help right here would have been, uh, <laughs> would have been awesome. Yeah. All right, well, there's some lightning. Lightning here. Two lightning in the gear. You want a gear? Or a cloud? Yeah. Here, I got a cloud storage. You already have a lightning. What's that? You already have a lightning. I do. I have lots you of lightning. You can store one over there. Oh, even up. So this is just a permanent cloud in my possession if I put it in my area? If you put that over there, at any time during your turn, you can collect one extra cloud. You have a cloud. Yay! We just talked about how great clouds are. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm going to put it over here. Oh, it's going towards you, though. Yeah, I want to see what yeah, else the city holds. And let's spin this well, we, Joe and I kind of blocked him off. And let's go over here and flip this thing. Yeah, let's flip that over for you. You have the mansion, another one of those gold ones. If you have more robots here at the start of your activate city tiles phase, which is on your cheat sheet, uh -huh. than any other player, activate this tile and gain two. Blood, so, Blood Boiler is our resident Euro gamer. Oh, okay. Heavy Euro gamer. And he says this game seems terrifying. Oh wow! <laughs> it's probably the, the the amazingly bad teach. That's why. It's amazingly bad teach. Activate the stock game too, huh? Well, that seems cool. Choose another lightning bolt. Get another guy on it. How did you How did you do that? Yeah, Add another lightning bolt. Oh yeah. Okay. Um, now notice that he's starting to get to the part where he's got to make a decision. Does he want to activate his tiles before he does? Because once you move a robot or start pulling gears, you can't here, activate it. You can't go back and activate and take link bonuses. So we we have to play these three things in order. What three? Oh, these three things in order. Yeah, you have to play these. You can't go back now and say, "Oh, I want to activate this tile. I forgot." No, sorry, Jesse, it's too late. Well, no, it's for next time. Yeah. Um, so I spent all these dice, and I'm good with the resources I have. So okay, that goes over to you. All right. Go BJ. What's that no. die? That's that extra one for the casino. Uh, if you want to roll the casino die. Oh, he got. Wow. <clears throat> he's got lots of choices here. He's got gears. He's got clouds. He's got a uh, lightning bolt. So it seems like wow. the first part Don't of this game this is one. discovering the city. And that's when we celebrate, the city's been discovered. And then you're just kind of building your results. And you're pushing your luck. How, right. how far can you keep building your engine before those three tiles are, not four, before right. three come? And there's a, there's a variant where you only pick two and it ends the yeah. game. I've had it happen where my wife and I played that at the, anytime during your turn, you can get one gear. 
Yep. Move one of your robots one tile before activating the tile. Probably casino die. Oh, that's I nice. I plan on it eventually. Yeah, so Jesse moves your robot off the tile you really want to, you can move that one back on. Because remember, movement comes after activating. So Jesse, if you zap one of his robots back over here, he can move his robot right back on. Uh, that's a pretty cool tile. I haven't done that to him yet. Not yet. Yeah, but when I, I play, the first time I played with my wife, we pulled the third one. The third and the fourth one were the last two gear links in the bag. So the game lasted for a while. Oh, wow. you know, hour and like oh I'm already minutes. doing actions by drawing those yeah, tiles yeah, you're out. Doing your actions. Yep. So I can't activate. I'm too late. You were supposed to do that before, yeah. Supposed to do that before. Did you want you told me you didn't want to activate that thing though? No, did I did. I did want to. I just oh. didn't have a lightning. Are y'all okay? Is it prison rules? Oh, you here? didn't have what a lightning bolt. Oh, yeah. yeah, I have a lightning bolt this it anyway. time, but last time I did. Wait, you rolled and you got a lightning bolt. I know, but I didn't understand the order. Oh, okay. Well, do it now. Then I'm okay. You guys, with that. you guys were just, you guys just gave me this, and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna draw well, some I didn't, things. I didn't. It's not prison rules here, is it? <laughs> oh, wait, no, 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 actually, it is. <laughs> is it? Oh, okay. no, it's not. Okay, so y'all gonna let me do that? I want to see if the tw the Twitch chat hammers you for. Uh, we're taking them out of order right now. <laughs> they don't care. We're just this is a learning game. <laughs> Two points. I forgot what your tile does. You gain uh, two points for each gold tile. Yeah. Oh, he's got the robot occupying it. He's gold. Yeah. But you know he's coming Did over here. Do I ever destroy this robot to do that? No, no. no this just have... means present. It doesn't mean to pay. So oh, okay. Kind of confusing. Here, but... So these ones are already spent out of order, and then this I'll put here. Put my thing in there so I can go over here. Oh, I can't move. I don't have any movement. You have the green. Oh, I do. He said he wants somebody to roll the uh, casino die. We need, we need to activate that tile. I'm going to go man. over there. Let's do it for fun, man. Yeah. What's the worst that could happen? Nice. You lose I can actually get points. And lose the game. Yeah. What's the worst that could happen? Yeah. Explosive. You can't lose what I don't have. Oh my god. Oh, you were talking about the clouds. Here Spend we go. Spend three clouds to destroy any robot. Any robot on the board. Spend four clouds to demolish any gear. Any gear on the board. Wow, that's a mean time. Even, a, even when a it's in play. someone's uh, personal um, thing? No, that's a gear link. It looks like a bridge, oh, so okay. that reminds you that it's a gear link. Um, this right here that says gain one movement when you build a new thing. And you did, so yeah. give yourself a movement. Yep. But I can only do that once per turn, right? Yeah, so remember that you already used it this turn. So. Oh, I'm done anyway. So. You don't have to do that, but it just helps. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I like that. Especially when you, when you start having you know a bunch of gear links on the board, it's you know, remembering how it is. Yeah. So some people play differently. Some people play explore the board right away. Chris Leader said on BGG that he doesn't. He actually just kind of sits back and builds up his engine and builds them one. He'll give them all the little two-point bonuses because he wants to build up a lot of the, you know, he wants to take all the activation bonuses that he has here. Because once this happens, those tiles go in. So, right. you done, Rob? I think I am. Baby luck. Come on. I don't know if there's anything else I can do. I want sevens. Come on. Um, three clouds. Junk. It's junk. Oh, it's junk. All right, so uh, do I want to activate? Oh, uh, man, I think I am going to activate here. So I'm going to burn this one. Okay. Oh, I don't, I'm not occupying it. Oh, man. Spend one of your, oh, you don't have any movements. Oh, man. No, and once you move, you're done. I should have done like him and moved my back robot up. I messed it up. Okay, it is what it is. So I'm going to uh, take the one uh, thing and come over here then. Try to get a uh, gear link. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You have to be able to move I think there. I, have to, to, um... I think I have to move to here first so that I can put the gear link. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to spin this to move a robot here. And then I'm going to spin this to pull it up. Oh, I didn't have to move on to here. You did move your dude on here. I know, but you're saying... To discover it, yeah. In order to discover it, do I have to move someone there? Yeah, you got to move, okay. move on there. That's the question I was trying to understand. Yep. So I'm not going to be able to discover it because I am out of movement. Oh, well, it is what it is. Uh, it so is that was going to do that. I am going to put this... How do I send out another robot? How do you what? Get out more of these robots. 
If you want to buy these guys here, anytime. No, the ones that are already standing up. Use your lightning bolts or your uh, movement tokens. Move, like just like the other guy. Yeah. Like that dude right there. You could have spent that guy on your turn to move that one to here. Uh -huh. And it's free. Is it, uh, not free, but it's part of your movement. All right, okay. I'm done. Yay. Wow. Last time we came to this wow. festival, BJ, you taught us a game called The Flow of History. We did which Melissa then in turn went and bought, and we played it on stream. Oh, yep, yep. And that's all thanks to you. We did play it. One she bought the game. fancy version. One of the all few right, times I've version. ever won that game. Yeah. Final turn. <laughs> Somebody was playing military cards the whole time, and I was just ignoring Last military. time we played, I was playing all the two military Two clouds to a gear. Okay. Do that one time there. All right. Now, when you pull gear, that's it. You're, you're moving on to performing, performing actions. Unless you're just converting it to a gear. In other words, do you want to activate tiles right now or not? No, Earlier you were talking about activating and yep. then some other way of using tiles as sure. well. So right now I've got these two tiles here, right? And I've got them linked up. If I want to, I can activate this tile. I spin a cloud and a gear and I gain two points. And then anything connected to this tile, I can actually take the link bonuses, which are at the top. So that would have given me another top, another gear, if I want to do that. All right, I'll take a cloud. Good. Yeah, that because you're also that, uh, standing there? Because, because no, religion. not that. It's because of this. It's any of the link bonuses. So I'm looking for tiles that I'm linked. For instance, you're here. You're occupying this one. So if you do this right here, you can also take any tile that is linked back to this one. So Joe, if, he, if Joe activates this tile, he can also take that link bonus, which is a development bonus. That's just grabbing a tile and sticking it over here. Okay? That's what this blue thing oh, okay. is. Okay. This one is a movement token. <laughs> oh, These are yeah. what? Link bonuses? I went ahead yeah, and link really bonuses are if you activate a tile, you, you can go good? back to anything linked to it as long as your link comes up and take it? them all for what free. Is that one? That's a movement. I can't see it from here. It looks like a, a movement and a gear. I can't, I can't see it from here. It says like movement slash something. Like play something down. It's a moving or a die, right? It looks like a die. Oh, okay. okay. Well, I'm activating the tile I'm on. I do have more uh, than any other player. Like a reroll. So I'm gonna gain. Looks like a die reroll. Um, yeah, in that last game of Flow of History, I completely role played my group and went here, all yeah. religion. Oh, did you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It didn't cause me to win or anything. Oh, it didn't? Oh, no. I was role playing instead of playing the game. Oh, so with the link activate now? Uh, are you activating your bonus right now? I did. Or you I which tile? I made it the tile I'm on. Then you can get this free bonus right there, whatever it is. Can't see it from All here. Up top. Is it's, it a point? It's a point. Yeah, yeah. give yourself a point. But it does, does it activate the one before it? You, you don't have a guy there, right? So it doesn't, oh, it doesn't have to have a guy there. If he's here, wait. Okay, we did this backwards. Put that point back. Are you activating this tile? I'm activating the tile I'm on. This one? Then you get that bonus, whatever it says. Okay. And then you get this one here because you have a link to it. Okay. You don't and need a robot on, on it. You just need it to be linked, linked to oh, it. Oh, to get the link bonus. Do you Which have to have a robot on it to activate it? You have to have a robot on it to activate it. And you know that because it says the little robot symbol okay. at the start of your activation. Links do not have a robot on them. So all you have to do is have a... Gear to the it. gear to it, okay. that's, and that's what the gear is around. Yeah. It reminds you what the what, what so you the need casino. To get that. Let's figure out what that bonus let's do it. is. Uh, well, the bonus is. here is going to be a movement, or uh, looks like a reroll. I can't really see it from here. Man. I'm guessing a reroll. So I collect like something here. right now. So small. What's that? Yeah. You can collect a movement or a reroll of a die. Yeah. How do I collect a reroll of a die? So you re -roll oh, a die. just reroll a die. Yeah, reroll some or all of your unused dice, or get a movement. Or yeah, move your choice. Reroll or the resource shown. He wants to move up. Like, that ain't getting like, oh, oh, we got, got a little cheat sheet in the back. There we go. Yeah. He's got a little reference guide. So. Cool. Thank you, Gray Fox, for including the reference guide. I appreciate yeah. that. Let's grab a gear. Did you All do right. the video for this one? Yes. Yeah. Uh, gear, please. Oh, oh yeah. You want to draw one? Okay. Yeah, I'm doing draw a gear. Guys with sticks riding in tanks? That was me, yeah. Wow. They were religious zealots, and they didn't believe in really military. They just had sticks, <laughs> but then someone brought in a tank, so oh. they just decided to take that. That rolled it out, huh? Yep, that's what hey, happened. Hey, Dave, it's your favorite game, man. Oh, yeah, I love this game. We're playing some... Tell so the this truth. This one. Tell the truth. This is, Dave this, put uh, the table at BGGCon when we played this. Oh, yeah. How many times is this year? Well, for a point? 
a cloud, cloud for a point. point. Yep. Well, you point. would have a use for clouds. I know. <laughs> you can do it one time, though. Hey. <laughs> one yeah. time. You've got a little two point. One, one time, time is round. bad. Yeah, yeah, one time per, per round. He's got a two point. Yeah, one time. One time per round. I am not mad at that. I'm gonna grab another gear. Blood no, you blood. already went into the thing. I did. Yeah. Is that a problem? You get to go into the gear bag one time. Oh. As many gears as you want to spend. So take your gear for next round. As many gears as you want to spend. All right. So when From you dive dice. in, when you dive into the thing, notice that it says here, draw gears once uh -huh. per turn. And that's oh. all you do. So you have to reach in and grab two. Turn. Is that right? Hey, we'll, we'll see. Spin. Thank you, you for that follow. You can't say I'm going to spin one gear, draw it, we and say, ah, that was okay, that. I'm going to spin another yeah, gear. Oh, I had all intentions of grabbing two. <laughs> yeah, we'll grab two then. I'm fine. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I didn't know that was a one-time thing, because I was definitely taking that. Yeah, once per turn, you can dive into the bags. I gotcha. Uh, Thanks again, we'll see for that follow. We're here on now, uh, Mondays, put, Wednesdays, and Saturdays usually. Now, you put yours over there, right? I did. Okay, so that one would have to go on the board. That's or the I, reverse, however you want yeah, to do it. Yeah, I plan on making some links happen here. You can't put two in the same place. No. Only time that'll Can happen. I ever decide to like destroy one of these and replace it with a new one? No, but when, it, when a, whenever you fill up this board, you can replace the one of these with, with a new one. Oh, yeah, that's what I meant. Yeah. So it's the same. It's basically the same concept. Only time you could ever dive into the bag twice is if you get like this thing here. Spinning this movement? one here is a development token. Okay. So you're going to do it right away. You're just grabbing one. Do you spit that? Uh, okay. Yeah. Let's get him out here and let's spin this lightning bolt. Move this guy over here. No, he's in my area. He's actually, no, y'all are, are tied right now. Two to two. I'm going to use this cloud for this point. What does that mean? At the end of the game, Take a look at this little point thing right here. The bottom right-hand corner of each tile shows you what the, what the points will be worth at the end of the game for whoever has more robots and gear links connected to that. Oh, so it doesn't matter if they stand in there. Not right. I can still go there and do whatever I want. You can still sure. do it, yep. You can I'm still done. do it. Good. All right, roll it up. All right, well, um, I don't want to do anything out of order. In fact, you know, if you move on order. to him, you can actually destroy him with a zap if you move on to his uh, tile. Send him all the way back to That's the That's not the way you play. <laughs> Don't destroy me. Okay, if I roll these dice, I can still do other stuff. Yep. The first thing you do is roll production dice. Okay. You're good. I don't want to do something out of order. Step one, no, roll. Step two, activate tiles. All right. Okay. Before first you thing dive I'm gonna into do. the bag. Okay. Activate your tiles. Move my guy before I activate a tile. That's what I it have says. A special ability. Yeah. Oh, that's so awesome. Okay. So I'm gonna move this guy to here. Okay. Hello. Hello. Malta. Now he occupies the tower or owns the tower. Yep. Okay. Oh, but I don't have what I need. Oh, but I could. Oh, I know what I could do. Okay. So now activate tiles, right? So if I. Uh, Which tile do you I, want to activate? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I mean. This one or this one? That one. This one. But can I use these resources to activate that tile? Yeah, you can spend two of any uh, resources using fire, this fire. thing. To make a lightning bolt, because you don't have a lightning bolt, yeah, right? Yeah, that's what I want to do. I want to use You also these. have that one that, that you haven't used yet either. Oh, let's do that. So this and this are going to go together to make a lightning bolt. Got it. All right. That way I can get two points. All right. So he spent those, and he's got two points. Okay. Now, do you want this link bonus? It's what free. It? You get a cloud for free. Okay. Or you can spend clouds to do this, but you don't have enough clouds to do it, right? So. Right. All right. Okay, so now I have these things. Okay. Um, so now I'll grab gears. All right. This is called Gears of War, right? Yep. So grab uh, two gears out of the bag. Where's the black bag? Not called Gears of War, by the way. Chad, it's <laughs> not called City Gears of Gears. City of Gears. City of Gears of War. Play his robot, Ron Sputin. <laughs> Did you play a Scythe? Um, Rise of Fenris. Rise of Fenris. I haven't played it yet, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> we haven't, we just haven't broke it out yet, so. Uh, yeah, we, we did it all on stream, and they, uh, I got a reputation as being a warmonger, even though I'm not a warmonger, because <laughs> I ended up playing the warmongering race oh, outside you? of my control. And the yeah, chat sure. forced me to be a warmonger. It was in your control. <laughs> if I didn't do it, I would have had to give it to you, and you would have loved to have been the warmonger and kill and slay everyone. So, is, is it a true legacy game? The it's, it's not a legacy, legacy game. It's, it's just, just a campaign, campaign game, right? It, there's nothing gets mutilated or torn or changed no. or anything. Okay. So it's really a campaign game. Definitely a campaign, yeah. 
Oh, I'm gonna put, put this one out. Is the chatter right if y'all spoil some of the stuff that's in the game? Or? Well, we advise that they don't watch if they don't spoil. Well, yeah, I've we tell them ahead of time. They're spoilers. I've heard there's new factions that come out in the. Oh yeah, the of course, of course, yeah. 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 But it's kind of common knowledge, right? Yeah. We just blur the whole screen. No. <laughs> Did you really? No. no. Okay. They know yeah. that they're funny. <laughs> they know that there's... It's the audio version of iHeart Board Games live on Twitch. Okay, that's it for me. 20, 20 Done? Minutes okay. I'm oh, I get to get time. a movement. All right. Because I built a thing. Yeah, man, he's just loading up. He's got this I know. movement he's got, engine over he's here. He's got man. the engine thing going. He never has to roll. He doesn't have to worry about True. spending extra stuff. Oh, I can, rolls are he doesn't have to go too. through what we go through. All right, what, so what are you guys talking about? I need to. I want to activate. You got this two tile. gears. Yeah, I want to activate this tile. So I'm gonna. I got I'm three gonna split clowns. This you got two gears. And this, I'm gonna burn that, and I'm gonna activate this gorgeous tile here. It's gonna gain me two points, right? So I'll take Just my like little that. two points. Like oh, three, yeah, two points there. All right. Where are the rest of your points? That's all my points. I got, I got no points. <laughs> the rest? But I'm gonna get this free gear back, right? Uh, so I'll take my gear. That's why I watch Charter Stone. Never watched Dude, it. Oh, never watched it. Oh, sorry about that. Now, oh, yeah, Charter that's right, Stone. All right, now I'm going to move to the uh, actions. I can move some robots. Well, well, you got to get your group playing that so you can go watch I, our Now I can move I over here it, if right. I had something yeah. to move oh, with. Yeah. But I don't, right? He's got to get his group going. Yep. I got this and I got this. Okay, I'm going to spend uh, this guy and this guy to move. Oh, man, that stinks. I just don't like my uh, rolls at all. I'm not going to go to it yet. I'm just not ready. Nope, not going to do that. Leave a gear here. I'm going to take a cloud there. And, uh... Oh, Dagnabbit. I'm done. All right, you're up. Good. Dagnabbit. Right. Wow, you did it again. Three well. clouds again. Great. Uh, you need to be over here. <laughs> so, I'll, um... I'll activate... I'm just giving it up. I'll activate... <laughs> Um, Which one? You got four clouds. Oh wait, you got five clouds. Yeah, he's got a crazy amount of clouds. It's tough. And a free movement. <laughs> and so I can do. Which one you want to activate? This one or this one? Or both? You can activate both. You just don't get the link bonuses, which is okay. Yeah. Well, the problem is, Blood Boy, that we already I, played that game. If I activate game, this so. one, I get the link bonus, right? Yeah, you get this link bonus here, which and is free. And we all regret it. Except if you do person. this one, you're gonna get that one, which <laughs> is putting a development tile on one of your your, one your tiles. You're gonna put a. Basically, it's a. I'm sorry. You get a, a development tile for over here, yeah, okay. which is pretty cool. You know, it's a, it's a free it's a free shot. So I get a I, I grab a gear and put it down here. So. Yeah, exactly. That's what it'll do. Or I get a movement. Or you get a movement. Whichever one you think is more important. How what what's the uh, what's the ratings on the venue? Awesome. Are we, are we happy with the venue here? It's here. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah. It feels. Uh, um, I heard some people complaining about parking. Yeah. So. Yeah. I didn't have to deal you, with that personally. You know, the, you know the snafus happen, right? So yeah. we tell everybody what to do with parking. We have a free parking garage across the street. Big, beautiful, and it's free all day, right? Yeah. They didn't tell us that there's a 5K race that runs <laughs> here in front of the student union today. So they closed the street. So at 7.30, yeah. after after all of us, we're already here because we're setting up. Oh, no, 8 o'clock. I'm sorry. After 8 o'clock, after all the setting up, the police come and barricade the street the hour before the con opened. So only people who came early were able to park. Everybody else had to park on streets everywhere. They waited two hours and then they released the street. But by that time, everybody was here. Oh man. Yeah. And of course, we're oblivious. We're all inside. We're la la di da playing yeah. board games. Okay. We have no idea. What you got? I'm gonna activate. I wanna get this link bonus. Okay. So which? So activate this tile and take that link bonus. Spin a zap. Okay, so I have to do that. Yep. Two. Yep. To do that. What do you get for doing that? I return any number of uh, robots from your city tiles to your factory and gain one for each you return. All right. So I just you return one what? One prestige point. So I just cool. return that one. I'll get By the, the link way, bonus. Give here's that poll that uh, he was referencing. Oh, did I? Yeah, there you go. Well, never mind. All right. So now you finish the activation. Oh wait, okay. Because you don't have Nightbot now. Yeah. Nightbot right. needs to I'm stop gonna... trying to listen to what Stream Elements is doing. And I got nowhere to store this. So. What is it? A clown. So that's yeah, a so new one. You one. have any more die? Mm -hmm. You could spend these two. Oh no, you already used your converter yeah, bonus. Yeah, I've got too many. It's just going to be overage. Yeah. You're going to lose it. Nightbot. You you could spend this stuff to move robots if you want to move robots out. You can spend these two guys. To no, you can't do that. Never mind. But you can spend this to move a robot out if you want to. 
Oh, I've never seen that thing over there. Oh, it's an advertisement. Whoa, what is this? This is our poll for our next legacy or campaign game. Mice and Mystics? Wow. So we're letting our chat choose what we're going to play next. I'm moving right out here. Hey, where's City of Gears? Pump it up. Both <laughs> this City isn't of Gears. A, this legacy. isn't the legacy. No, I, game. Get, I get, so I use, I use a movement, but I get a movement from down here. So I just oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. And now I'm done. All right. All right, Jesse, you're up. All righty. Blood Boiler, you okay. missed it this morning. I played uh, uh, Captains of the Gulf, which is a Euro game about the Gulf of Mexico. Uh, hey, look at you with all your gears over there. It's a, truly is the city of gears. Well, let's trigger some uh, things I'm so on. So I thought you said whenever we reveal all the... Oh, we haven't revealed yeah. that one over there. Yeah. Yeah. He, he and I... I can't... I can't well, what are y'all this, waiting on? We, I didn't have gear. I got three clouds again. You're going to activate these two, two of green them. I did. The guys are oh, wait. I don't movement. have any lightning. We have no lightning or movement ever. I can We're change staring at each two other. resources. Um, let's do that. I'm going to... Swap this. Somehow I won. I don't know how. <laughs> Let's do don't this in this me. cloud. Maybe because they were all helping me because I never played before. Let's convert in this into a lightning bolt so I can activate these two greens. Over here? Yeah. Okay. So that gets two points for every one of these you're on, so that's four points. And you have yeah. some points right there. You should. Four points. Three and I think we gotta get over there. Man. Three and They're one. Killing. I know, ain't like, I just need one gear. And then it'll be this other one, which is have more robots on there, which I'll get two more. Wait, where are you at now? You activated the both of them? One. Yeah. Okay, so you're not gonna get link bonuses then. You just want activation. I just want activation. You, I'm also you doing can the still casino. do this one though if you want. Oh, you can activate yeah. that one too? Have you gear. have enough resources for all that? Uh, I rolled wow. the dice first. Oh, okay, yeah. This yeah, one was good. a conversion. Yeah, you good. Gear. So I'm left with the gear. But now I want to do a casino thing. Roll the die. All right. Because I like to gamble. Here we I go. like I Roll like it. to gamble. That is a gear by itself. That gives me one victory point. Yay. Man, he pulled that up five victory win. points in one turn. Nicely done. Oh, yeah. I pulled in way more than that. It was what? You had the four. Four plus two plus one. Oh wow! Yeah, seven victory seven. points. That's, not bad. that's pretty good. Not bad. Not bad. When, it, when two and a half million is a winning score, you're you're very two close. Two and a half million. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> close. Okay. Uh, no, I still no, have one still gear. Okay. Let's do a gear grab, I guess. And you did your cloud per point also? No, I didn't do that. Did that. Yeah, you ran out of resources. Yep, ran out. That's okay. Can I borrow that? Sure. I used it. Used you one of my the bag, the black bag. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. I want to get some cool abilities. I've got nothing. You got nothing. Oh. Something good? Not really. Um, well, we could start making more links here. What is that junk, what, junk shop? The junk shop. That's the one where you can borrow other people's dice and use them, you just give you them You have to give them points. victory points, yeah. I don't want to give anybody a victory points. Do that. Yeah, it comes out of the bag, man. What do you care, right? I mean, you got all these? You got... Let's link over to that yeah, explosive plant. Now oh. the true colors oh. come oh. out. <laughs> I haven't done anything yet. Give him one more turn. Setting things up. <clears throat> setting wow. things up. And he I'm will doing. be destroying any and everything he, he can is. reach. It's gonna so be that's in the And he's turn. got that cloud factor over there, man. It's just going <laughs> to generate all the clouds. He's the Steambot. Look, Steambot Industries. I'm Steambot. Yeah, we forgot to say what our names are. I'm Nice Corp. Nice, nice Corp, <laughs> really? Oh, Mech Corp. Mech Corp. Mech Corp. Yeah. And I'm Cogswell Investments. Oh, Mecco Corp. I'm, I'm Future Vision Technology. Future Vision. That's future what vision. I like. Is it future. me? Oh, we yeah. see it's clouds. All dice, that's the first thing. All in the future is clouds. Uh, the next thing is move one of your robots, one tile, before activating tiles. Oh, I guess I still have to pay, for the, pay this, right? You still have to pay that, yeah. Okay, well, I'll send out another robot from here so they can be free hands. Okay. Um, I could use that to just zap him and send him away. So you, you, uh, once you start doing that, though, you're going to miss your activations. Oh, I need to do my activation yeah. first. Well, then if I spend this to activate my tile, I yep. get two points. Take that. But now I don't have any more of those things. Oh, I also gain a point when I roll one of those, so... When you roll a what? Uh, lightning bolt. Wow. He's got, he's got the best tiles over here, man. Okay. Um, so you activated this tile? Do you want to take the link bonus here? It gives you a free cloud. 
Okay. Do I have to, like, take this yeah. or just... put put it on the uh, thing right there. Yep. Okay. So if I want to kill him, what do I do? Spend some zaps. So now you're on the perform actions. You can do them in any... Uh, you can kill a robot that's on your tile. Pay one to, to zap him. And it'll send him all the way back to the factory. But he can come back just with one oh, lightning Oh, yeah, he's bolt. not dead. He's, and he can come back with one lightning bolt. But, and of course, unless you destroyed move. that with two... Uh, if you had three zaps, you could destroy this and move him back to the factory, and he couldn't I go back on I don't have that, but I spin these two clouds. Okay. Here you go, Jesse. Bye, Jesse. You're back in your home. I guess. Yeah, all the way back oh. to the start. Did oh. you just attack me, Ronald? Yeah. No, what? I did it. It's, this is City of Gears Rise of Ronald Gears. loves his war games. City he doesn't Gears, let anybody know that, but he really does love his war games. Um, okay, next I need to... I have these <laughs> things. Um, something really important needs to happen gear. here. Yep, Ron Sputin conquers. Ron Sputin returns. Ron Sputin. Ron Sputin like 2, City of Gears. <laughs> okay, <laughs> these, this, this can just be a gear. All right. No, I want to pull a gear. Oh, you want to pull a gear. Okay, right over there. Pull a gear. Oh, don't get me spinning up like a weirdo. <laughs> Uh, take a video or a picture. Oh, oh right. I like this one. I don't know if I should build it or keep Ooh, it. Oh, keep it, keep it. Gain a point when one of your robots is destroyed. Oh, <laughs> so like what he just did to you, you'd get a point for it. Nice. I had a robot destroy thing. I didn't think anybody would do it. Isn't that part of this game? Yeah. Zapping is part of this game. Sure. You generate zaps, man. Yeah. I'll just put this here. I didn't think Rob oh, would do it. Oh, he changed his it mind. It's coming on to the gold. Okay. <laughs> Done? I still have this cloud. Oh, okay. Hopefully we have basements. We can have it in his attic. <laughs> My turn? Yes. Oh, oh this game right for North Africa? What is that? Is that a That's game? That's a right huge game you lay out on the floor. <laughs> We live in Louisiana, there's no oh basement. Oh my god, here. no one's ever finished that game, Campaign for North yeah, Africa. It's supposedly been like 15,000 hours or something like that. It's crazy. It's a crazy game. All right, so I do want to uh, activate Never been play tested. So, <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Right? <laughs> I don't think so. I'm going to spin these dudes Yeah, here. we're still here, we're Jesse. We're still alive, yep. We're we hoping to go till points. about 9 or 9.30 Central Time, or until they tell us, stop that, please. <laughs> yeah, what time do they kick you out here? Uh, 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock. Close up at 10 o'clock. Good to right. <laughs> I got my two points, and I want to take that link bonus there, so I'll take a little gear. So it looks like the crowds have migrated to the other side of the room. Are they really? So we have some empty tables behind us, but over there, it's quite full. Yeah, it's really full on the other side where the gateway games are and yeah. the demo area. I'm going to play a zap. And also they <laughs> left for two rooms in a booth. So a bunch of people maybe yeah. may have gone for that. Oh, no, but wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. They're just on the other side of the room, right? They're not out in the hall, or are they? They're in some other place, I'm assuming, because they need two rooms next to each other. And a boom. Right. Oh, I think they are playing. Is that where they're, they are playing uh, Two Rooms in a Boom now, huh? Right? Yeah, but I don't know where they went. They probably went down the hall. I mean, Maybe they went to the men and women's halls. room. Uh, uh, yeah, they just went to the hall. bathroom. Yeah. <laughs> are you the president? I'm just trying to use I'm the bathroom. To to this one. All right, so I'm going to spend. Uh, Can I see your card? Is that what you call it? <laughs> I dare you, sir. I'm going to spend a gear to pull one uh, out. Uh, oh, I can spend two gear. I'll spend, uh, no, I need that. I'll spend one gear here. Pulling out, see what I got. Yeah. You guys are long gone. Now we're <laughs> today we're well, going late. That's for I also sure. have to have this. Twelve hours. Oh, double one resource on the die. I think I'll take that. Okay. I we like did that. have a little bit of downtime when the computer and, uh, locked up. Uh, no, no, I still got these two. We did our first so I got Skype to that was all the way to there. Uh, but today's been steady. Take We've take had their awesome connection here. I'll take another uh, gear over here. Much better than home. And no I will kidding. Spin a zap <laughs> Has that gotten any better? This At home? Yeah, yeah. Fine. Get this dude out. It's, uh, you're not still using your phone. And I'm done. No. You're up. But it's it's good, it's good, it's good, and then it's bad. <laughs> this is a one day event, correct. Yeah. We're back to normal. At this point, week. but this is only their second year, so you know maybe in the in the future when they expand, they'll expand to more days as well. I right. can neither confirm nor deny. <laughs> that next year will be longer. Yeah. I cannot Ooh. confirm that or deny it. Well, I've heard tales well. in the wind about it. Yeah. something like that. Yeah. We can only hope. <clears throat> yeah. 
I think as one day is just not enough. We were talking that we would like to grow organically, so getting uh, you know people interested. We're still a mix of about 50-50, so 50 pe- for 50% of the people that are coming in like you guys who play tons of games yeah. and, and uh, can help teach. We've had a lot of help. Beyond the people in gray shirts, we've had a lot of people just teaching games. <clears throat> but the other half of the people are people that are still just, wow, you know, they're drinking from a fire hose right now. So yeah. um, if next year we're ready for it, we will. So I walked by right over there and saw some people <laughs> with a sign that said, teacher wanted Teotihuacan, and I'm like, I'm up to the challenge. Did you? Yes. Oh, awesome. Yeah, because I looked yes. for somebody that knew it, and I couldn't find anybody. Yeah, I went so. over there and laid it on them. I was like, you guys picked a heavy game, and they're like, oh, we're hobby gamers. And I'm like, okay, okay good. So yeah, that was the okay, goal. Here we go. Way back turn that yeah, that's the Sinlaw group. The Sinlaw group has been games all day. By the way, any of you guys out there, once a month, Sinlaw oh, group has a, a big game group like this, right. and they meet for about, so about the last, 10, the six hours, thing. something like that. Where is that at? Industrial Industrial yeah. All right, so Medio is going to stop the game, and we're going to dump these guys in there. Oh my! And from now on, it's a race to see how long the game is going to be. Get these on screen. Put things like right here. Oh, which side? Is it? Yeah, red. Uh, Wild Travis was sighted. All right, Joe, tell us what the tile is. So this is Industrial Collective. This is permanently installed, lie down, one of your robots on this crowd. tile to gain three it's points. It's actually a very All right, small so you can crowd. send a robot out to here to and just uh, kill him. We've our own space There's, here in the corner. You can't move him, you can't do yeah, anything with him after that. And, and once you install one, you get plus two when, when you activate bag and yep. turn. So you gain so three. three white gears yeah. just went into the bag for the first time. These are little holders. I'm not sure. Can I see that bag? With a... All right, what you got now? With embroidery on the bottom. Or game gumbo. Okay, I get another movement. Oh, look, they show up pretty well. I was on there, off man. play. I get another movement. I have to talk into Ronald's neck because that's where the mic is. <laughs> <laughs> where were you? What were you doing? I right. was playing Sparkle right. Kitty Nights. Oh, you're what? over there with the uh, Gulf Coast Gamer guys. They love that game. Yeah, Sparkle was it? Kitty it was Nights. An experience. <laughs> I want to play Sparkle Kitty and Nights. Will you teach me? I would. <laughs> and I'm done. What is that? How was your cake for dinner? He says delicious. All right, just you your up. cake for dinner. Yeah, I Gluten had two free. pieces, and I actually saved the second because it was so rich. I was like, "What? Well, <laughs> actually, uh, what's, his, what's his face bought us dinner? Did he really? Yeah, you got to reimburse me. Greybeard bought me That's dinner. That's true. <laughs> Yeah, we got a tip from Greybeard. One for uh, the wow. New Hope organization, and then one for us. Hey, thank you, Greybeard. Thank you for supporting the foundation. I don't know if he's still on right now, but yeah. I saw him earlier. <laughs> I saw him earlier. Yeah, he sent a tip right, for Jesse, the, the nonprofit as well. But um, all right, what did you eat for lunch? Same place they had. They they brought me the wrong thing. I had waiter twice today. What did you eat? Um, well, I got Papa John's the first time. Papa here, John's. Here, here. You can get that anywhere. Yes, I know. He's gluten intolerant. Yeah, you gotta so be careful with that. Rule. Yeah. We do have a couple of restaurants in here that specialize. Yeah, but see, like not knowing them, oh, yeah. I, was, I was like, I just need something quick that I knew yep. I could eat. Yep. Um, but someone had recommended uh, Blue Dog. Blue Dog, yep. Yeah. That cake, and so I got that cake. The gluten free cake, yeah, the, the no flour cake, yeah. yeah. By the way, the crawfish enchilada from Blue Dog, shoot, yeah. the bomb. At Dude, it's the bomb. Let's activate both of these tiles. So first one's gonna grant me two points. Which one you at? This one? The, the one I'm on, green one. This one. Did somebody already answer his question about these bit cups? Yeah, they're uh, board game gumbo. These are BJ's. This is this is his company, board game gumbo. He does um, live streams on Facebook and all kinds of stuff. Yeah, he's like he's interviewing like, and all fun stuff. Oh, BJ's. You guys have been Do on you the know show. If Randall's is still around with the music and the dancing. Randall's is still around. Has live music on the weekends. It's out, actually, out by my house. Randall's. If you like Cajun awesome. music, uh, if you like Cajun food, there's a lot of other restaurants you can always visit. <laughs> <laughs> but if you if, if you like Cajun music, it's a great place to go. I don't know. Where where all do you board game gumbo? Not just Facebook. You have. And so we run a on Yeah, we run a weekly game night here in town. I also have a blog uh, that we write uh, reviews for. Uh, for different companies, and we have a Tuesday night, 8:30 Central uh, Standard Time Facebook Live show that you guys have been on. Yeah. So that yeah, was really awesome. And you're also on Dice Tower. I'm also contributing to the Dice Tower. Uh, yeah. I do the crowd surfing stuff for the Dice Tower. Well, only about once a month for that, though. Please ask me if the horrible rumor about Joliet's closing is true. Oh uh, yeah, that closed a while back. So yeah, unfortunately yeah. it did. That's <laughs> the same people that own the uh, Blue Dog, and 
It was a fantastic think. restaurant. Graybeard doesn't live too far away. Yeah, you, you must be he pretty could, close, He Graybeard. could drive in if he he, he, really, he wanted to get the scope this year, and he said he might come next year. <laughs> Graybeard, you should just know, come. Well, he's also the one that left the nice tip, so. Oh, <laughs> no, I'm sorry, Graybeard. <laughs> that was a fantastic idea to wait one year and then to come back. I totally agree with that. What are we doing? So I got a ton of gears. I'm going to use one of them to activate the casino. Let's, let's yeah, gamble. You activated this tile already, right? I did. Okay, and then you activated yep. that. He doesn't like link bonuses, Joe. He likes just activating. Yeah, I want to see. I want to see results. He's got the stuff. When do we get? Oh! Our oh! oh! That's one, right? Yeah, two, right? Is it two? Just one. Just one. Oh, one. Okay. Yeah. All right, give me that. This is a victory point. And it goes to the green player, right? I was just gonna. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> when do we get the other Man. die? Oh, oh, shoot! Yes, you were supposed to roll four die. There you go. So uh, give yourself one die. I'm sorry, what? Since, you you since, were supposed to roll the fourth since die. Since we flip that over, I guess that's when we get it. Oh, yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah. Not you, of course, but he starts. No, yeah, I understand. I got you. My bad. No, we're just I making that. clarifying that because that's why. Appreciate that, Ron. I missed that. Cool deal. Lightning All bolt. right, so I used the gear, and now I'm lightning over bolt. to lightning my bolt. other. Lightning bolt. Do you yes. remember that video? Yeah, <laughs> yeah you're native. You want the lightning bolt? Oh, I'm probably gonna use it. Okay. Lightning bolt, lightning bolt, lightning bolt. Magic missile. <laughs> Magic missile. I upset all my so robots. So many here. Gears. Yeah. He said he spent a lot of time here when Hard he worked say. with Vision Logistics. Probably not me. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Transport company, if I remember right. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, Joliet's closed down. Yeah, a lot of our guys don't use Facebook, yeah. so that's why they were kind of just curious where all you, you know, we're all on the internet. They could find you. Yep. So. It's anywhere you do. Uh, it's at Board Game Gumball. So you can uh, check it on Twitter. Or oh, yeah, he's active on Twitter, too. Oh, yeah. well, if you have Facebook, I doubt you have Twitter, but you know. Yeah, or YouTube. <laughs> I'm on YouTube. Yeah, so yeah. I do post up the interviews. So uh, we had uh, we had Tom Wetzel from Cosmos Games last Tuesday. And we've got Trump Elizabeth Hargro Hargrove. Right. We've got Elizabeth Hargrove coming She's on this show. She's the designer of Wingspan. Wingspan. Oh, she'll no, be, I want the gearbox. I she'll be coming back. on the show in a couple of weeks. I never want those gears. If you pull out white gears, the game ends. Awesome. Right? It's, yeah. Let's Something like that. Yep. <laughs> if he pulls out, when, when he fills up that little box right here, the game immediately ends. Oh, so anytime one of those white ones comes out, it just goes right in there? It goes right there, yep. You get to pull another top. Let's put this over here. That could be useful later. What, what does, does that say? Double one link bonus you collect. Ooh. Yeah, oh. nice. I like you that. You can get more clouds. Totally. Which would yeah. give you to, like a lot of clouds. Yeah, a lot of clout clout. clouds. Uh, so I have a lightning. Let's use that lightning and get out there and do some stuff. Um, let's go here. You burn the lightning? Yeah. All right. That's a wrap. Oh, he's setting himself up there. I am. Oh, look at this. He's got a he's got a formidable row over here. I just can't pull. I, I just I keep spinning the gears on this, and then I don't roll the gears that I need. That's a bunch of junk. What's happening? I'm gonna give Ronald a bite of my cake. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. Is that steady? <laughs> so let me just have it now. Is that right on the live stream, man. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see that on the live stream. There. Oh my god. Here it is. We're testing. So long. We've got I'm half of his face. Right. Thanks. It's, do you not like it? It's good. It's not as good as my homemade one. I would agree. <laughs> Ronald does make an amazing flourless chocolate cake, and I'm not Mike, so you can't hear me. Never mind. It does look good, though. <laughs> okay. Important. First thing is, move one of your guys before activating tiles. That's probably one of my favorite tiles on the board. Because I, getting your robots in the right spot huge, yeah. to do the activation or the link bonuses is, is important. And he's using it to a great advantage there. So yeah. okay, right now, I'm going to activate tiles. And he always leaves himself a movement so that the next round he can do it. Well, I have that bonus. Yeah. I, I always get a movement when I... Yeah. So yeah, it works awesome. together. Okay. It's a, it's a good little combo he's got going on. These here. two are going to turn into a electrical shock thing. Okay. So that I can activate this. So I can get... Four, um, He's got four points, points this time, yep. Yeah. You've got it going on now. Go check on Melissa over there. Man, I can't believe the comment. She looks happy. Oh, yeah, so Melissa is helping us out with Coimbra. 
She's actually teaching Coimbra for uh, my buddy Bradley. I couldn't be in two places at one time, Jesse. But yeah, <laughs> I'll um, turn this into. Oh, oh I can only okay. go into the back up in chairs. I can only go into the gears. Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah. Melissa yeah. checking it out. Yeah. So here's what I'm gonna do: make Travis this a gear cake. and make this a gear. So okay. that's gonna be two gears. Okay, got it. Out of the back. And you've used that one one time, so you can't do it again. All right. No, 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 no. You're right. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, did you already use it before? No, yeah. you did. You converted yeah, that to a zap. That. Oh, that. that's okay. Ooh, I'll just a chat take, room. Did you see that? I'll just take two gears then. Oh, yeah, just take the gears. Yeah. I was just trying to get rid of this junk. All right. Ronald wants to roll up two gears. You going to punch Travis in? Is that? He's going to get on mic. I just wanted to chew on, on camera. <laughs> Are they talking about my cake? Yes, Melissa. Oh, oh, he pulled it's Melissa. one. Melissa, she's in the Oh, we room. got one. Jesse pulled one. Ooh, I didn't pull one. He did. No, no, he did He's not. Saying I Jesse, exclamation oh. point. He pulled one. <laughs> yeah. I see. Make sure we get that right. Yeah. White right gear, shut the game down. Yep. Three of them, and it's over. Oh, I'm gonna definitely take that. So who's winning? Uh, it's hard to say. The points are a secret. Yeah, Joe, I don't remember if you pull the thing, I if you get another tower or not, but we're not going to worry about it. I just don't, I don't remember <laughs> yeah, the rules. Where do I put don't remember. this out here? What is this even mean? Which one do you want? Check. Do you, do you want it here, yeah. or do you want it out here? You want out there, but where should I put it? Well, it doesn't matter, because you're going to flip it over like that. I know, but where should I put it? Uh, wherever your robots are, you can connect to another. And remember, it's area control at the end. Right now, you're beating him, but he's trying to. He's trying to come oh, back. Oh, when I activated this here. tile, should yeah. I have gotten like some kind of bonus? Yeah, you thing? should have gotten your link bonuses. Uh, oh, this on you can take that one Changing and these this five. one, and that one if you want. For this five. Okay, so we'll. So that gave it? you a cloud. That okay. gave you a cog. A cog for, for over here, and that one gave you another little uh, wheel. So let's put that over there. And that one gave you a cloud. Put that one over there. This allows you to, to draw one and to install draw one. on on the board in the board. Yeah, yeah, you can install that last spot. So over here. Yeah, no, over here. Oh, yeah. So draw one out there. If you want to, you can put it there. If not, you just throw it back in. The, oh, actually, I think you discard it. Yeah. But that so you convert a cloud into movement. That's actually not bad for not those. Not bad. Remember what I was saying about yeah. not having movement? Those clouds yeah. can that would let you uh, convert one. So okay, so where should I put this? Oh, uh, it's going to be up to you. Do you, do you want to make sure you win this one? one? You want to try to get this green one so you can move over and get even more points when oh, you activate okay, that I'll one? Do that. Seems like that's the best thing to do, right? Yeah. I'm going to just seed my game and, and coach. Um, so can, when can I buy another robot? Uh, anytime on your turn, you can spend two points to buy another robot. Big spender. Oh. Two points hey, to get a robot. Spender. Gambler over here just throwing points oh, away. Wow. Could have had a and robot. then I'm going to turn it's like the game's over. Half, half a robot yeah. into a movement, and I also get a movement because I built a gear. Yeah, it says draw replacement gear. So okay. he did it right. Okay. So when you when you pull this, you get to draw another one. Yeah, and he did it right. Oh. He, he, he now, did. when I drew that gear, it says right here, draw one extra gear when you draw gears. Oh yeah, you were, so you were supposed to draw two gears, pick one, and and put that other one. So anytime he draw, uh, draws a gear, he gets to draw one extra gear. So. Must be nice. Yeah. And you're going to decide between that one and that one for that. Which he, he obviously oh. needs them, so it's good. I'll just throw that No, back. it goes over there. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you remember which one it was? Yeah, but I mean. Is that it? No. I'll find it. <laughs> <laughs> the reason is because it's the shortening of the game. You know, we don't right, want to put it back right. in. So, Ronald, you're done? Yeah, until so I find that dice. card. Uh, let's see. Uh, I do have that, so I can activate this. Apologies if you're waiting for dice throw. We're actually replacing that title. We're going to be playing Fire in I'll the get Library. My two points. This is a quick, Sorry, uh, oh, I'm still okay. learning this game. Yeah, you're fine. <laughs> you're doing fine. It's all I fine. Do this I still have this left, though. Uh, I need the Forever Queen here. Oh, oh you get the. Oh, okay, you did. What's up? I didn't know if you had rolled all four. No. Uh, man, I could pull a bunch of gears. You want to hold on to it? Gears. There's also a trash can. Mine. I'm going to pull. Uh, let's see. We're in the student union, I'm sure there's like, that. like that. plastic forks somewhere. Oh. So it doesn't Spoons. cost me anything. Uh, I'm going to pull two gears out of the bag. See what happens. I have no context for the end of the game, game here. is going. Nope, no end of the game. <laughs> You're doing better than I am. Yeah, 
Oh, how do you know? I've got like... You got six uh, points showing over there. Yeah, I know. I want to make sure I've got have, that one there. You have at the minimum nine. Let's see, where's that one that we're Oh. Uh, <laughs> I have seven. And you know those aren't all ones. And those aren't all ones, that's, that's, that's why I said the minimum. Most of them are ones. I still have a zap. <laughs> Not all though. Except for there's all a, of There's them. a difference between <laughs> most and, and so all. And I am done. All yeah, right. he got his cake, yeah. Melissa. He's already eaten the second piece. Oh, I get one extra zap because of doubled resource on the dot. All right, good to go. All right, finally. What? I get three gears. Oh, are you trying for gears? Yes. That was in the cloud option, but I just... Oh, you're going in for the... So, so you're not, not activating your tiles? Oh, wait, oh, wait. Oh. Should we have said something? <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's the friendly first What's game, wrong? right? Okay, so... At, as you saw, Joe and I didn't develop this tile right away. We didn't have, we didn't flip it over. Okay. If we had, the game would have been a lot shorter, right? I mean, sure. many turns ago, we just couldn't get it done, or we were doing other stuff. You can play a little longer game if the game, the game only takes about 40 minutes once you know the game. Uh, uh, maybe a little longer if you, if you have some really good engines. But if you want a longer game, you can move this back and put one tile in front of each person. Yeah. So you've got your own private tile before you get out there. So. It's one little variant Your that people own can play. private hell. Yeah. As far oh, as sorry. like, the, yeah, building the table, it's like you could build it all sorts of ways. Yeah, uh, actually, the in the back, there's all kind of variants yeah, to, I saw to building that. it. It's like a low, low conflict. Yep. Alternative setup. That's the way that we. That's the way we've been playing it. The only thing is, it, it does add a lot more to the length of the game. And I find that Chris Leader has said people can want a longer game. The fun is actually the surprise in this part right here, pulling out those tiles. So it's one of the few engine builders that ends before you want it to, and it still feels good. You know, most Unless engine builders, the they always end too back. early. You, yep. you want that one extra turn? This one is fun because everybody's engine ends at one point, you know? So mm. I think Chris is right. I think the shorter game is better. And if you're playing with Dave, he won't flip the table whenever you play. So, right. <laughs> so, if I <laughs> just, oh, that's what I heard. If I activate this, right? Oh, what's up? Which, which link bonus is doing So I this is the one you want? Any link bonus that you have the blue things connected to it. So I get this and this. You can get both of those. You can actually activate both of these and just take that one link bonus if you want. You can activate as many as you want oh, yeah. and I mean, take these, whatever's remaining. These are just moving them. They're not doing that much. Yeah. But if I activate this, I just get one point, right? Yep. You want that? I don't know if I should lay him down. You know, my wife almost flipped the table in this game the first time. She was so, oh yeah, she was so mad. She like, now she likes it, but. And this, I get to draw and install It can one. be a little right? mean in this game. I guess I just had a I get to draw yeah. immediately. In this yeah, you draw game. immediately, yep. And if you have any. Everyone goes, hey, you should take this guy over here. He had it rough, so he was playing with a, with a young lady who had never played before, and she loved the zaps. And every time he would even move close to her tiles. I thought that's what was going on. She was zapping all your robots. I'll activate this one and do one. Oh, oh, yeah. I'll yeah. do that. To attack me. Yeah, and, <laughs> and she so listened to him. Yeah, yeah. Right, I get a movement. There was the tall. Yeah. <laughs> He's I not got, paying attention. And I got to pull one. I movement. was not playing in that game, so. Wait a minute. So Joe's the, like an autopilot. He's got to figure it out. gear for that. Okay. All those gears you've been rolling. And now I get, I can pull three uh, gears. What's next on the schedule? Um, that's Fire, the in the Fire in the library. Fire in the library. We're changing dice throne. Yeah. Why you wanted to play dice throne? <laughs> Y'all played root before, right? I drew, yeah, I I drew a white one. Oh, I drew none another of white us one. Played root. Uh oh. Oh wow. That game only got like checked out like twice today because the people who took it. Yep, I drew the last white one. Sat on it for hours and oh, wait. hours and hours. Look at this. It's oh, that's it. That's the game. And you know what else happened to the root expansion? Wow. Somebody put some of the pieces from the main uh, game into the root expansion. And so people and tried to play the game and they, they couldn't find all the pieces. <laughs> So all right, it. so that's the end of the game. Let's get the uh, chart out so we'll make sure we do it right because it's very important who wins, right? Yeah. So what was what about those gears he was that's just drawing? That's it. That, that is the end. Get to in. He doesn't get to do anything. You, uh, The game ends. So game ends immediately oh once the third God. opening token is drawn. The player who drew the last opening there does not finish their turn. Does no resources can be drawn. Gonna, nothing can be exchanged. Nice. Nothing. Uh, this is what I pulled that didn't get installed. The end game roll one die and I get like... I can get up to six oh, points. Man. Oh, that sucks. That stinks, man. <laughs> That's terrible. All right, go city by city, and we're going to award prestige tokens based on the city. So let's start over here. 
You know right? what? Who's winning this city? Red. That's Red. me. And that's how many tokens? Three. Oh, that's three? All right, so give yourself three points. How about this city over here? Well, yeah, you're dominating that one. Me so for four. four. Here. Red. Red. Red for three. Three. All right, here. Yellow. I've only got two. Yellow's got four. Red. No, actually, yellow's, yellow's got five. five. Yeah, red's only got two. So he's clearly got that's that. That's my home planet. So, yeah, so that's here. three points for Ronald. Here. Ooh, I barely got you by that one. One, I got three and you have two. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to get my four points. Uh, over wow. here, Joe, I, it's close. Wow. But I'm going to call it Joe's title. I'm going to say Joe's got the okay, five no, points. No arguments? We agree? Yeah. And I think Joe... Oh, Joe, you just you beat me by one over here. I was trying to sneak in, but it's only worth one, right? Because you never laid down your own, yeah. dude. Well, we should have all went to so Joe's yeah. home planet and fought over it. It's yeah. worth five points. We should have played this like Ethnos. Right? This one is three, and then you and I did not battle for this one. You won that one, so that's another three points for all. Okay. All right, so that's... We've done the prestige points for the actual thing. So next up, any... Any in-game scoring that you have. I've got one in-game scoring, that's the gray ones. Right. Uh, it's got a little in-game at the top. And mine says, score one for each different resource you have stored on your factory at the end of the game. So this is nice. So you get three points. I'm gonna score a nice little three points. Mm -hmm. This is gray, right? What if it like? says in-game, sorry. Oh, it's a gray okay. one that has in-game yeah. on it. So okay, I'm, I'm yeah, just gonna throw this one yeah. back. Yeah. I don't know what you do. Gray. Anybody else have that? I get a move. No, I don't. All right, nope. reveal All right, your prestige that. tokens and count them up for the win. Let's see what we got. Did you get your regular last place, Baron? I did. I I'm sure I got my last place. <laughs> no. I'm absolutely positive I got last place. No, you didn't. I'm I, don't think. I did no, get 70s. Didn't. I can tell you that. I got a total. Maybe my worst score ever. I got 20 points total. A big fat what 20 points. What happened here? I have 26. Joe? 15. 15? 26. This is, seems low. I got to still count. No, no. Uh, to get yeah, Dave, this we is drew a, this these is things really quick. No, we, I only have 21. Wow. Hey, Jesse. All right. Oh, Jesse, nicely done, man. I Jesse, thought I was in the lead. Done. I mean, Joe pulling, what, two of these in one turn? I, I thought two, I was yeah. in last place, and I thought I thought Joe was doing better than me. I, I kind of scored a bunch of points in that last couple of years. I had 20. Yeah. And I, had I was right behind you. 21. Yeah, I was right behind you. And Joe? 15. Yeah, 10. Yeah. And that's City Gears, designed by Chris And those are totally Darryl. normal scores. <laughs> mm, Bradley scored a lot of more points on this. But, uh, you know, right. it's building that engine. And I again, was just getting started. I was yeah. like, ooh, on my next turn, I'm going to make bank. We yeah. pulled those things in the second round. No, actually, we started with him. you only got one. Yeah. You, it only went around once for you, right? Yeah. Or twice. No, he pulled one, and then when it counted to me, I pulled the other two. So. Yeah, that's it. Wow. So, wow. So sometimes that happens. I mean, we I still mean, we still have tons of uh, things in here. Yeah. Okay, yep. We, not uh, that many. Have you played uh, no, uh, The Wizard like, Always we were Wins? We pulling a lot of gears up. I have not. Uh, yeah. Yeah, good? there's a mechanic in there where if you just pull the exact right thing out of this bag, and Travis pulled it out when the bag was chock-a-block full, and it was like a one out of 50 chance that he was going to pull that out. And he just pulled it out and won the game. Oh, yeah. The Wizard always wins. <laughs> All right, so that is City of Gears, man. Thank you guys for playing it with me. Oh, and yeah. we are, we're you. almost back Thank on you. schedule. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully the teach wasn't too rough. No, it was yeah. nice. Yeah. I was pretty rusty, so. So you guys, we're going to take a short break before we come back to play our final game of the night. Yep. So um, Fire in the library. hang tight with us for a few minutes, and we'll be right back. Ladies and gentlemen, it's all relay. Yeah.